Welcome children. We are doing Natural Vegetation and Wildlife Chapter 5 MCQ. This is the part 2 of total 3 parts MCQ. Let's quickly begin. Which factor influence the type and distribution of natural vegetation? Soil, climate, landform or all of these? So I think you could have guessed it is the all of these. When was India's first bio reserve set up in 1985, in 2001, in 1880 or in 1986. So let's check it out. So children if you see and if you have read the book Nilgiri Biosphere Reserve. The Nilgiri Biosphere Reserve or NBR is the first of the 14 biosphere reserves of India which was established in September 1986. It embraces the sanctuary complex of Vyanath, Nagarhol, Bandipur and Mudumalai. Alright children. So when was India's first bioreserve set up? In 1986. Rubber belongs to which type of given below? Vegetation, Tundra, Himalayan, Tidal or tropical evergreen or tidal or tropical evergreen so children rubber belongs to tropical evergreen let's also check it out on the latest textbook so children if you see the tropical evergreen and semi evergreen forest uh, part of the textbook it is written here the semi evergreen forests are found in the less rainy parts of these regions and a lot of details and then it is mentioned here the rubber. So the British also used timber for construction and they also had the forests were also cleared and introducing plantation of tea, rubber and coffee. So rubber was in tropical evergreen and semi evergreen forests. So the correct answer, rubber belongs to which type of given below vegetation? Tropical evergreen. Which type of vegetation does not belong to the category of natural vegetation? Forest, horticulture, mangroves or all of these. So children, it is very easy one. Horticulture is something which is aided by human being. So it is not part of natural vegetation. Which type of vegetation usually develops an undulating on develops on undulating and rough terrains? Cactus and thorny bush, mangroves, grasslands and woodlands, or none of these. So children, actually this MCQ, if it comes, it is from the previous textbook, but I will tell you the answer is grasslands and woodlands, and we will just read it out. So children, if you see uh, it is written it's on the previous book, it's part of the previous book. So the undulating and rough terrains are areas where grassland and woodlands develop and give shelter to a variety of wildlife. So answer will be grasslands and woodlands. Which term is used for the original plant cover of an area which has grown naturally. Naturally means without the aid of human being. Is it garden, agriculture, virgin vegetation or indigenous species? So correct answer for this children is virgin vegetation. Let's also read it from the book. Natural vegetation refers to a plant community which has grown naturally without human aid and has been left undisturbed by humans for a long time. This is termed as a virgin vegetation. Thus cultivated crops and fruits and orchids form part of vegetation but not our natural, are not natural vegetation. Which type of vegetation is common in fertile level lands? Cultivated crops, grasslands, forests or none of these. So children we know on fertile and level lands we do cultivate crops. So the answer is cultivated crops. 
which term is used for virgin vegetation which have come from outside india endemic species exotic plants indigenous plants or none of these so children answer for this is exotic plants let's also read what is written about it in the book so if you see the virgin vegetation which are purely indian are known as endemic or indigenous species but those which have come from outside india are termed as exotic plants so correct answer for this is exotic plants where in india did you with where in india did the royal bengal tigers are found or godavari delta sundarban delta mahanadi delta or none of these that's very easy it's sundarban delta name the natural habitat of indian lions gir forest evergreen forest thorny bushes and scrubs or tundra region so children very easy again it is gir forest in gujarat which is the natural habitat of indian lion also reading out the part of the book india is the only country in the world that has both tigers and lions the natural habitat of the indian lion is the gir forest in gujarat and tigers are found in forest of madhya pradesh sundarbans of west bengal and the himalayan region leopards too are member of the cat family they are important among animals of prey the bio reserve is uh, in not included in the world network of biosphere nanda devi manas gulf of manar or dehang debang so children answer for this is so children answer for this is dehang debang don't get confused because you may find manas answer in lot of quizzes and mcqs and i will tell you the reason for dehang debang so children if you see the latest book this is the table 5.1 list of biosphere reserves so children if you see the list of biosphere reserves nilgiri nanda devi nokrek mana sundarban gulf of manar they are all listed here dibru sakhova dehang debang and in the note if you see sites with bold letters have been included in the world network of biosphere reserves of unesco so those which are not bold the option which we have is dehang debang okay this is part of upper siang west siang and debang valley districts in arunachal pradesh so correct answer for the bio reserve not included in world network of biosphere is dehang debang what is the position of india and the world with regard to plant diversity first 10th 12th or none of these answer is 10th which term is used to denote animal species of a particular region or period so children we know we call flora and fauna so flora ferns fauna none of these so denote animal species is fauna the next question again this is the last question for this part children which term is used to denote plants of a particular region or period fauna ferns flora or all of these so answer is flora and children thank you very much if you have liked this uh, video please do share with your friends and do comment how you liked it and i wish you all the success and good luck for your exam and life keep watching my videos and keep liking thank you i will be uploading the last part very soon